compression. Well, um, compression isn't a blue operation. It is instead, let me just uh, go and get the one here with compression, compress, uh, compress after mosaic. So this one was going to geotiff. If we wanted to compress, um, this is actually showing off. I'm also reprojecting here after mosaicing, and then I was going to ECW. And that compression does take a little while. I think this one here, um, this is a pretty big one. I think I ran it last night. It took about two minutes. So let me just show you the result of, uh, of looking at that thing. There it is. So um, this is an ECW that's, how big is it? Well, 10,000 by 10,000 approximately. And um, I don't know, Dave, are there parameters that can control the amount of compression? You can set the compression ratio. Oh, there it is. Yeah. So to, to do that again in slow motion, I right-clicked on the output. I said uh, properties. Actually, I didn't. I actually just hit the dot, dot, dot. And then it brings me up the properties. And then at the far right, there's the format parameters. And that's where I can put the percentage in. This is a fair, is that, what's an aggressive percentage? Um, an aggressive percentage would be anything higher than 80. Okay. Uh, I think uh, after that, you're starting to see a little bit of degradation in the image. Right. But the, the, the default 75 will give you an image with almost no visible degradation. Right. So that's, uh, that's ECW. We, similarly, we can do it for JPEG 2000 as well. Yes. Um, we cannot write Mr. Sid. Our lizard tech friends won't let us do that, but we can read it. Yes, we can. So, uh, so you can go Mr. Sid to ECW if you wanted to. Yes. Not that we're encouraging that, but it can be done. So um, here's some of the other formats that have compression in them. 